press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Prior to the inception of the research and analysis wing, overseas intelligence collection was primarily the responsibility of the Intelligence Bureau, which was created by the British. In 1933, sensing the political turmoil in the world which eventually led to the Second World War, the Intelligence Bureau responsibilities were increased, to include the collection of intelligence along India's borders. In 1947, after independence, Sanjeevi Pillai took over as the first Indian director of the Intelligence Bureau. Having been depleted of trained manpower by the exit of the British, Pillai tried to run the Bureau on MI5 lines. For intelligence failure during the 1962 Sino-Indian War, led then Prime Minister Jawaharlal Nehru, to order a dedicated foreign intelligence agency to be established. Around the end of 1966 the concept of a separate foreign intelligence agency began to take concrete shape. The Indira Gandhi administration decided that a fledged second security service was needed. The Research and Analysis Wing, RA is the Foreign Intelligence Agency of India established in 1968. The framework of Indian intelligence RA started as a wing of the main intelligence bureau with 250 employees and an annual budget of 291,052 US dollars. In the early 70s, its annual budget had risen to 4.4 million US dollars while its personnel numbered several thousand. Objectives of RA Monitoring the political, military, economic and scientific developments in countries which have a direct bearing on Indian national security, and the formulation of its foreign policy. Molding international public opinion and influence foreign governments with the help of the strong and vibrant Indian diaspora. Covert operations to safeguard Indian national interests. Anti-terror operations, and neutralizing terror elements posing a threat to India. RAW has been organized on the lines of the CIA. The head of RAW is designated secretary, code name R, in the cabinet secretariat and is under the direct command of the prime minister. Operations by RAW The number of operations done by RAW is known by none. In this video we tell some famous operations done by RAW. During the first nine years of RAW quickly came to prominence in the global intelligence community, playing a role in major events such as the independence of Bangladesh, and the accession of the state of Sikkim to India. Operation Smiling Buddha On May 18, 1974, India detonated a 15 kiloton plutonium device at Pokhran and became a member of the nuclear club, security was given to RAW. Operation Magdut In 1984, in a very important call to the Indian military, Ra informed that Pakistan's Operation Abbey Bill was planning to capture the Saw Toro Ridge in Siachen. Thanks to the timely dip, the Indian Army was able to launch Operation Magdut, which forced the Pakistan Army to retreat even before they could enter the territory. Cordial War Ra was successful in tapping the telephonic conversation that took place between then Pakistan Army Chief, Parvez, Musharraf, and his Chief of Staff, General Muhammad Aziz which confirmed Pakistan involvement in the Karjali incursion. Sri Lankan Presidential Election 2015 It was alleged by the Sri Lankan newspaper The Sunday Times, that RAW had played a role in uniting the opposition. Controversies and Spy Scandals In 2004, there was a spy scandal involving the CIA. In 2007, there was a spy scandal involving Bangladesh. A Bangladeshi DGFI agent concealed his nationality before joining RA, and was known by the name of Duan Chand Malik in the agency. On March 25, 2016, Pakistan claimed that they arrested a RA operative by the name of Gaul Bashan Jadav, who was operating in Baluchistan province under the cover name Hussein Mubarak Patel. Pakistan claimed that he was carrying a passport under that fake identity and used to operate a jewelry shop in Chabahar, Iran. He is believed to be a retired commander ranked officer in Indian Navy. According to Indian sources, Pakistan has fabricated the documents on the retired naval officer, and leaked them without realizing glaring loopholes in the same. The Iranian president, Hassan Rouhani, also dismissed Pakistan claim and state them as mere rumor. Hope you like our video. Hit the like button more updates are coming. So, please subscribe us. Thanks for watching.